Hello everyone, I'm Richard Chen and welcome back. Today we'll talk about the Lexus Interface Password. The new Lexus models come equipped with the owner's profile database system. After the owner gets into the car, it automatically imports the owner's preferred settings, including dashboard preference, seat settings, phone configurations, radio preference, and even volume when playing the music. It's very thoughtful. The owner profile database has three options. Owner 1, Owner 2, and a guest. If there are no specific settings, the system will display guest. Typically, when you purchase a new Lexus, the dealership will assist you in downloading and setting up the Lexus application on your phone. This application not only allows remote control of your door locks, also enable remote start and the location tracking of the vehicle. After starting the vehicle each time, the Bluetooth automatically searches for the paired phone and imports owner's information. You will see a welcome message along with the owner's name. If the owner's phone is not nearby or the person driving is not preset owner, it will prompt for the relogging. Similarly, if there have been changes to the owner's information, it will require re-enter the password to confirm the owner's identity as seen on the screen. If you forget the password, you can reset it on your own phone application. Here is how. Open the application and tap on the small person icon on the up right corner. Then tap on account settings. Select security settings. Choose reset pin under the account pin option. Then enter a new six digit password. Confirm it by entering again. Alternatively, for a more convenient method, you can use facial recognition to confirm the owner's identity. If your Lexus has face ID settings, you can enable it. There's a device above your steering wheel like this. Actually, it's a camera, and one of its functions is facial recognition. This way, you don't need to enter password each time. Just face scan to confirm your ownership. Our car can pair up to two owner profiles. Each person needs to download and activate their own Lexus application. This makes it more convenient when switching drivers. However, if both owners are in the car simultaneously, the car won't know who is driving. In this case, you need to manually select the driver's profile. To sum up, it's not complicated. Give a try. Thanks for watching. I'm Richard Chen. See you next time.